Hello everyone and welcome back to the city of Finkafin in City Skylines. My name is Ben Pope. We have a nice view of what is firstly the little UK district in the Gherkin itself. Plus a whole bunch of windmills right behind it in Windmill Hill. Nice tourist area there with an actual Dutch windmill. As I'm overshooting it. It's not spinning, but it's a nice mod somebody put in the game and it's been there forever. So it's just a nice addition, you know, that kind of helps us stick to our roots with um, what we're representing here. And we're, we're actually representing, you know, the, the town of Finkafin. It's a small city somewhere in the Netherlands. Uh, but it's grown in this game from what we could possibly have imagined to uh, even more than... I don't even, I'm actually not sure what I'm trying to say. But yeah, look at it. It's big now. And today we're going to focus on this area here because not much has happened in this area. We have a um, small historic district with museums and tanks and star forts and uh, parks and shopping areas and so on. Uh, but, you know, with everything going on there, people just have forgotten that there's all this space here. So I think we're going to um gonna focus on that we're looking at the like it's supposed to be the biggest church tower um minster the biggest church tower in the world of course brought in by another mod and here we kind of let things we kind of let people build whatever they wanted so it looks like a you know semi international um uh, area with you know a tall tower the giga store and then, you know, a couple of... There's an actual Giga store that's not as tall as this one. Uh, this one's doing better because this one has a dead person. Uh, something's being built here. So this is uh, what I'm going to call the New International District. And we're going to just lay this out. Hopefully really quick. And let people build whatever they want. We're going to make them recycle. Uh, we're going to give them boost to parks recreation. And... Uh, smoke detectors we're not going to text them any, any different we are going to do a high rise ban which means I don't really want any like tall tall buildings if that makes any sense and um, we're going to give them the high tech housing because you know we want new stuff it's the new international district and for themes I'm going to enable theme manager and um, golly I think I think we're gonna have to select everything really we can't we can't do like you know this and this I mean it actually does the switches so we could do European not the high rises uh, you can do all of these not industrial but these guys as well might not work like expected that's all right some buildings are apparently not working um, which I should have let's see semi detached housing let's unclick that one because I have this I have this somewhere else I'm using this in another part of the city and maybe I don't want you know that house to be like totally uh, looking stupid I don't even know where the rest of them are yeah okay well there they are semi-detached I guess there's more semi-detached so we'll um, connect th that one and this one anyway um, so that should pick everything. Did I save it or did I just like... It saves anyway, alright. Okay, so enough of that. Let's lay down some roads. Um, it's busy here, isn't it? Let's see if we can, we can just make this an upgrade, upgrade this road. It's gonna look, oh, it's gonna look better as long as I don't touch this stuff. Is it we won't be able to update right there. So I like you can have one gigantic road and has it added Okay, there's no there's no stop signs, which is good. Uh maybe I can upgrade this road. It's going to mess up the buildings, which kinda sucks really. I, I don't wanna do that, but I will. I'll do it. Uh, I'm not going to change that side. 
So let's fix this up here really quick. Um, those guys will stay the same as they were before. There was a path for people to travel up this way. We'll keep that there. And our district starts on this side here. So that's going to stay uh, European style. And it should be... Let's see, themes. Yes. Okay, good. I do like the themes. That's a neat building, sir. What is it? Oh, it's just a commercial center. No big deal. Right. I know you're like, huh? I do talk to the game as it's a person sometimes. So hopefully you guys don't mind that. Space is occupied. Well, I think that just means that I it won't let me do... Yeah. So I'll have to do a... Um, two lane roads in there. Like so. And uh, let's remove that for now. We're gonna continue off this way for as long as we can, although... Uh, no, I'm just not gonna worry about it. I was gonna say, I might want another freeway entrance there. This one's pretty close, and it should hold on. It should be good. And if I need to, I'll um, make one over here, or convert this one to where it connects to the side. Does that make sense? I hope so. I hope, I hope that makes sense. Okay, so let's fill this part out so far. We will need... Something happened to my demands all, all over again. They just... they just got stupid. So the tall towers are gone. Now people have, have uh, went back to building... Uh, you know, not as tall. Which is cool. That should make it... It, make, it will make this really interesting. It will mean that we... We won't have like, you know, the, the tall buildings will just be there by the downtown and so on. Which I like. I think that's good. I think that's good. Uh, there's a lot of dead people here. So let's see. This this uh, might be something I can help with. Since there's this church here. Why don't we... Uh, why don't I actually make, make more road this way? Uh, and... Something like that, and go into this. See if we can fit at least. We can fit one of these guys here. I can put you on this side, really. I'm thinking, like, why not have a few of these cemeteries by the big um, building, by the big church, and maybe even a crematorium or two right here as well. There we go. Now, there won't be enough dead people to give all these guys work. There's a nice, uh, different... It's like a monastery style... graveyard, some kind of thing on, on the... Steam Workshop, and I was thinking about grabbing it. It adds just a different, cool, cool looking building inside. You know, compared to the small, tiny chapel that's here. Kind of helps. Kind of helps add variety. And I think people are going to want to move into over there as well. So let's give him... Uh, actually, we're going to give these guys offices over here. Because I think all this area needs some administrative assistance. Maybe some offices needed. So everybody's dinging and donging and leveling up. Might... I might want to put in some roads this way. What do you think? I could do one through the center, but that's just going to mess things up. So let's do one like so. It'll create some more traffic, of course. But what can we possibly do about that? Okay. Uh, that high school thing will be in the way, but we'll just do that right there and put in some, uh, you know, I'm, I'm 
I'm curious to see if they'll come up with some buildings that are mid tier but not high rises to go right there. So we'll fill this out with heavy density, high density residential and then we'll put in some more commercial over here. But I don't really need it so let's go back to this. I'm not sure what happened to my demands. They were fine just a minute ago before I switched to something. Uh, the roads or the this. I think I switched that and people were like, Ugh. never mind. We don't want to be in that city anymore. Go, go figure. Um, now let's do regular. You know, I'm not. I'm not gonna go. I'm not gonna go attach. Yeah, I'm not gonna go attach to that. I'm just gonna go in here, and maybe a bit farther out. Do this, and see if we can. No, you will do as I say. All right, and perhaps. Something like that. Fill this out. Of course, I'm filling this out and it won't like, you know, it won't actually fill out. Because I don't think anything is building right now. Which which kind of makes me mad. I was hoping to get, you know, the international district looking international and good for a change. Um... We're losing people at the same time, and we're losing money, so let's let's see if we can maybe wait out this dilemma. I, I, a lot of people have been born at the same time, and uh, now they're all dying at the same time. So it's not that I could do with more um, healthcare stuff. I mean, the crematorium is getting pretty full, but the cemetery usage is low. So I, I don't know. Go ahead and judge for yourself. What are you saying? A building burnt down? I don't care about that. Uh, how are you guys not happy about healthcare? What's going on? We don't know. Don't don't know. Apparently, they're just not happy about healthcare. But they have plenty of coverage. So maybe I can. Maybe I can add something to the next to the Gherkin. I do have one healthcare building there. I could put another one. I could put another one on this side. Maybe not that one. That one's huge. May I please build in the corner? No. If I do that, that is just gonna demolish two buildings, two nice factories. You sir are not supposed to be here, are you? Let's find out what's going on. Uh, make sure you're covered by this restriction. I do have a restriction in this area, sir, and you're not following it. Uh, we don't want to get the mayor mad at you. Let's see. Let's see if that changes. I'll just keep an eye on it for a bit. Our train situation is never going to get better. Uh, I believe, unless I, well, not even that. But I could do a, s a separate, whole separate line for the passenger trains, since they're going by, they're going through here as well. Even though that they're not, they're not stopping at the stations, they have to go through the same line, and that's probably something I could change. Very much something I can, I can change. Our um, IKEA is doing good, I believe. I couldn't find only one visitor, so they might go bankrupt. But I couldn't find a better spot for it, close to this uh, little Stockholm. Man, there's so much going on. Alright, um... What could I possibly do? I'm really upset about my... Demands tanking again. So let's see. Let's go to policies. Uh, we're still losing a ton of money. But... If we increase... Metro budget... That might get people off the street and into the metro. Uh, train, I'm not going to increase because then that would make more train traffic. 
um, harbor. I could do I could do more harbor and more planes. Buses. I put more buses on the road. Let's do it anyway. Of course, that's increasing my budget, uh, weekly income, st stupidity, <laughs> even more spending. Um, and oh my goodness, I'm at 89,000. We've just lost like 20,000 people. I thought I was going to come in here today and do like a nice new international district. But no, they're reminding me that I'm losing 1,000 people a week. And that uh, population is now 89,000 from like 113, which we had before. Uh, so to make matters worse, uh, I'm just going to wait it out, see what happens. Hopefully that will go back up. Let's just take a buzz. Buzz through the air, since I hear an airplane. And even the tall Stuttgarter Tower has dead people in it. That's how bad it's become. It really doesn't hurt me to... Uh, put more uh, healthcare stuff, you know, like crematoriums and stuff down. But because I'm losing all those people, I'm also losing all this money. So let's see. What's healthcare capacity is good. I still have spot. I still have places in the crematorium. And it's, and it's emptying. Like, people are actually, you know, going in as fast as they're coming out. If that makes any sense. Uh, this area could use a bit of help, so let's put one over here. It's, oh, well, I don't know. really want to put it right here, but I could. I mean, it's, it's kind of a utility area by this. Sweet. It's Death Valley in Thinkofin, as you guys can tell. I'm not sure why this person is so sick and can't get to the hospital. Maybe all the ambulances are all taking up, picking up dead bodies. How are we with the, with the healthcare? We're fine. Yep, we're fine. Can always do more healthcare. Uh, but we're now losing 22,000 a week. I'm not going to worry about it because we have millions, we have a couple of millions. Let's see. Uh, can we do anything? We can put more offices down in this oriental office zone. Not that there's any reason for it, uh, unless all the dead people need uh, to hire more lawyers. And lawyers are kind of at a uh, struggle to keep up with all the demand. Uh, to do all the wills. I mean, the dead people are not going to hire the lawyers. What am I saying? But the families of all the dead people are like, oh my goodness, we need more uh, lawyers in the city. Please build some offices for all those all those lawyers to come in. And I'm like, all right, uh, well, this is zone for offices, guys. So if you can get the lawyers to make it to the city, um, I think we have plenty of educated people. Let's see, university. Just click on that one, see what, uh, capacity, we have 29,000 capacities, only, only 5,000 eligible. And 92% of citizens have graduated from the university, so. Yeah. Uh, I wonder where the uneducated people are. Maybe if somebody lives in a van down by the river, which is possible. Where is that zone anyway? This was the zone that I was like, ah, if I could just put down a building that looks like a van down by the river as a house, I would do it. Because that's kind of what this is. Right, so we're only losing 21 people. Oh, that's 521. Never mind. Oh, my eyes. What happened? Come on, come on, come on. So yeah, I'm, I'm probably going to call this Death Valley. Uh, 2065 because that's the the year. It's where uh, a quarter of the population <laughs> of our city has perished, nowhere to be found, um, tossed into the crematoriums, and um, you know, good riddance. 
And I, I was so, I'm so gonna, I still want to do it. I was so ready to fill this out. And let's just do the roads anyway. Because uh, I was so looking forward to putting down like, you know, a sports arena, maybe even the Statue of Liberty. All that was a stupid spot for it. Uh, children in the elementary schools. I might not even need that. Let's see if I'm clicking on the wrong stuff here. But is this an elementary school? It is an elementary school. Okay, so I, I could use more elementary schools. Apparently. Uh, maybe you guys could use an elementary school. Is this a good looking school? It's kind of a dangerous spot to go to school. You know, this is actually this is actually a one by four or something. I could put this in here. I could put this like right here somewhere. Heck yeah! Let's see how it looks. As a my performance just take up there. You know, I really want to look at the school, not at the road. All right, let's go into the first person. Hey, you know what? That's pretty good. I like it. I like that as a school. There's more ambulances going for the sick and the dead. Why not? I'm sorry if that moving of the screen just got you all dizzy. Hey, our population is growing again. We're no longer Death Valley. That's probably one of the reasons that my demands dropped. Because people are just dying and nobody is able to go to work. Um, and there's all these donut trucks. Trying to make it to the harbor. I wonder where they're coming from. They're exporting things. They should have used the trains. I have plenty of trains. Maybe the trains are taking forever and then they're like, yeah, no. Alright, go. Oh, they never get to go. Cannoli. All right, let's fix this really quick, guys. I'm gonna pause this and put this train underground. I think I can. I think I can do it. Uh, there's maybe just enough space. Let's see if I even need to delete that. We're gonna go to trains, rail, uh, go underground. So it's too steep. Alright, so that that does connect it. Okay. Uh, let's just do a oh, come on, just do it. From there. Okay, and then up. Okay. No, I, I can't see it. What the hell? I thought I was doing this correctly. Alright. Underground. Uh, I have to be underground and then select this. Alright. So let's go up. And let's see if we can manage to get you connected back to normal probably not but how about a straight line do 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 I know I've uh, I'm always gonna be fixing the train lines I think just always Is that what you need to do? I do not agree. Mm. There you go. That's what you're gonna do to get to the train station. Alright, good. Got it. Now people can ride over and keep going. And... Uh, right. Look, there. Oh. 
Has that really has that really been there forever? They're just coming out here to like do a, a, a loop. The heck! Let's not put any trees though. Wow! All right. Well, that was pointless. They were they were sitting at the train line, the train crossing, just to then do a 180 and turn back around. Like that was. If that's been there the whole time, I am totally sorry. Um, that's really stupid of me. Yep. Okay. So, uh, we are gaining population now. T tomorrow, not tomorrow, but whenever the next episode is. Uh, it should no longer be Death Valley, and we might be able to recuperate our cost. And our demand should go up, and we will continue with building out the international district I'll probably take the time to uh oh there people are building here a little bit which is nice there's gonna be all sorts of houses see there's a corner house that's UK style and then there's like another one but then there's like a regular uh, house here and these might not stay forever because they are low um, level uh, so they'll you know we'll get like fancier looking houses of all sorts hopefully it still looks like a mix, nice mix that's kind of my my goal right so it has been Death Valley 2065 in the city of Finkofin but it's now recovering it's like that's what happens when you have a population boom and um, you know, they all come in at the same time and they all get born at the same time and then they all die at the same time. It looks like there's a uh, lost soul here uh, trying to cause traffic problems. And in fact, he has caused traffic problems. So ladies and gentlemen, he has backed up the whole, the whole way into our uh, castle hills all the way up to the bus depots. Which are not really bus depots, but it's bar t bus terminals, what I mean. It's where people do their grabbing of the bus up here. Um, let's see, why, why don't we just look out from the uh, London Eye and capture a bit of a view like this and call it a day. I think that's nice. Maybe I should beautify this area a bit more around the London Eye. Uh, yeah, I like it. There we go. Maybe not. I do like I, lo I do like this better. Yeah, I'm I'm just you know confused about what I want to do now. Okay, so I'll see you guys next time. Please do hit the like button, comment, subscribe if you're not subscribed, and uh, if you like what's on my channel, that's one of the reasons you would want to subscribe. Share this out with your friends if you think they would enjoy it. I appreciate all the comments and all the likes. I will answer all your comments, so go ahead and don't be shy. And hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.